but I feel like at the end of that match, the both kind of knew what they're going to do. Yeah. Um, but Justin was able to jump on that triangle. There's nothing wrong that Daniel did right there. I mean, he jumped on it, he saw it, and it was it was a great finish. Now we have Josh Hunt making his way to the cage. Uh, I believe he's one of your purple belts, right, Josh? He is. Yeah, yeah Josh is awesome. Um, He's been doing like, you know, a lot of these heavyweight matches aren't the funnest to watch sometimes, right? It's a lot of hand fighting, a lot of wrestling, and then we might see him hit the ground finally in, a, in the last five se seconds. But that all being said, um, hopefully this is a match that we see a lot of action. Yeah, and I think we probably will. So his opponent here is uh, Dalton Moss, who's a very, very skilled wrestler. He has more of a catch style once yeah. we get on the ground. But uh, I know he's a wrestling coach. Uh, he just competed not long ago against Zach Humberson there in Bridgeport. Absolutely. Um, well, and then also just mentioned on Josh, you know, he started his own gym. He's been training some kids and training some adults, been doing a great job. So Josh is the one running that Appalachian. He, yes. Yep, yeah, and sense. it's... Uh, I wondered who that was. If I'm not mistaken, I mean, he does a lot of it, you know, just right in his garage and trying to help some, some kids. Uh, I don't know if it's all free or, or not, but he's, I mean, he's just doing a lot of stuff that kind of his heart and trains a lot with Meta Jiu-Jitsu too. They deserve a lot of credit. Um, doing a lot of work with those guys, so... or sweep or try to get to his back once he's kind of tired well you know and that's surprisingly josh has a great game good leg lock game he you know maybe his build wouldn't make you think that he does but he really does he's got a well well-rounded game yeah so that's what i was saying this will be interesting to see if he because i think we're going to see somebody who kind of uh actually engages with dalton on the feet a little bit more yeah and i i've, I've seen i think josh and um zach wilds went basically the whole time on their feet one time yeah they did over here right over here on that corner in yeah. this building <laughs> yeah not the funnest to watch for people that don't grapple. It's, hell, it's not the funnest to watch sometimes if you do grapple, just seeing hand fighting if you're not, you know, uh, right, good into work, wrestling. Good work but. into the underhook from, uh, from Josh Hunt. He's able yeah, to push him up against the cage. He's starting to look in for a single leg. Yeah, nice power. Good takedown. Nice takedown there. Yeah, that looked beautiful. Yeah. We got him working right in front of us here. And Josh yeah. doing a good job keeping that uh, right arm tight to try to avoid the Kimura. Yeah. We'll see if these guys settle in here. Good job um, settling over, controlling the hips, making well, it difficult for, for Dalton to, to get away. And quite frankly, this is a decent pace for heavyweights, right? Like, yeah. You know, oh, yeah. He's passing. He's looking for mount here, but he's, he's keeping the downward pressure on, which we're used for heavyweights, but it's not a boring downward pressure. Yep, and we see Josh now moves to, to half guard from the full guard. He's got good control there. He does, he's got the far side arm isolated, which is what you really want when you're playing half guard. Uh, he's starting to work up now. He's in kind of a... Uh, yeah. A leg ride mount, but he's, uh, I think he, he's he's more concerned with kind of putting some pressure on him and gassing exactly. him out there. Yeah, right. and that's a good point. Where you might see some, some lighter grapplers would have took that mount, right, and kind of okay. pinched it in. Um, heavyweight grapplers are more like, let me punish you. Right? Yeah, and the, and the older I get, uh, the more I understand why guys like to play that leg riding style like Khabib does. It kind of yeah. keeps in control of the hips. Now he's starting to work towards the back. Now, but Dalton, this is still good control, right? Yeah. I mean, he's getting a little bit off to the side, but yeah. There's Dalton a good doing a good job yeah. controlling the hands, though. Oh, there's a hook. Leg in. But these hook. guys are so powerful. That one hook is not the same. Oh, good good job on the backside for Josh. Yeah. Trying to get that body lock. Oh, he does a good job of not seating the guard position. And for a second there, I thought for sure he was going to get turned and, and Hunt put in guard. Yeah, good scramble there from Moss as well to not get his back taken cleanly and force that transition. Look at that. Oh, wow. Yeah. He just really manhandled him there. Yeah, a little uh, bit of the parterre wrestling style yeah. there. Oh, he's now got, he's fighting the hands. He's yeah. under the, oh, he's he is under, under the neck, but yeah. he doesn't have a full RNC grip. Uh, so. I feel like he's going to probably finish this with this pressure. I could be wrong. But it can be difficult with uh, um, to get both arteries whenever somebody's fully bellied out like that, especially he, when he's yeah. fighting the hands like that. He might I be agree. Comfy. I think it's going to be more of a pain move if he were to get something. But yeah. And I'm only saying it because these are heavyweights, right? Like, yeah. I feel like that these are the kind of guys that put that pressure. As I said, the squeeze you know, sometimes yeah. can just be all you need. A lot of times this move will make somebody tough. Yeah. <laughs> it's heavyweight, right? Grind that cup into them, and it's it's not pretty, but it's effective. 
Dalton's a fighter, man. Dalton's yeah. doing a good job right now. Uh, Hunt only has one hook, and it's the top hook, which is not oh, really nice. what you want. But there, he's able yeah. to secure both hooks. He's got hooks and a harness, and now he's fighting for the chin. Uh, he's kind of going over the chin or naked hands. choke. Yeah, Nicky Rod style. Now he moves to a gable grip style. Over yeah, the but face. he's he's still he's cutting off the mouth breathing. Yeah, yeah see? very nice. Very Again, nice win, a move man. that might not work on a lighter guy, but these bigger guys, that big arm smashing the face down yeah. is just rough. Right? Yeah. It was a great match, uh, all controlled by Josh Hunt. It's beautiful. Beautiful work by Josh Hunt. And good good uh, showing there from uh, from Dalton Moss as well. I think uh, we saw a little bit of that weight differential once he was put on his back. Yeah. And, uh, you know, kind of the classic thing is somebody who's more of a catch wrestler guy, if you can put them on their back, they're usually not quite as well versed there as, uh, as a lazy jiu-jitsu guy.